Keep your eye on the minimap. Shocks lurking over towards those a holes as well. He can be a plan B or he can backstab. Well, there's the counter smoke coming out, but they're already committed to it. They're running through. Alex will pick up the one that's trying to track them through the smoke, and that almost works out. Immediate attempt. At oh my God! That can't really be happening. And electronic. How is he doing this again? Three kills and two of them. If you blink, you missed it. Apex and shocks now. Two versus four, and that bomb is. I mean, how can they stop that from being defused? They're all on there. There's shocks' his flank, and he's completely negated. The bomb isn't planted for him whatsoever. No, it's all the way in the corner. There's Perfecto and a follow up. And Flamey, who's the sole defender at this B bomb site. And they likely lose the round. Oh, pop flash over. That was almost a mistake. The pop flash was almost completely perfect. Now to the A bomb site. Electronic is down with just one kill. It's all on the rookie. He needs one more. Over the smoke. He's going to find Zaiwu very low. Right. They're setting up for it. There's the initial grenade, and they're already out in the corner. There's a bit of a problem now. Electronic down here. Yeah. He's thinking there might be some grenades coming his way. He's going to smoke it off and try and buy time. He was right about the grenade, and again, he lines them up. He's such an incredible player on this map. Apex now one versus four and he's doing his best to do some damage, but could be a little bit better But this could still turn into a, a return to B. That's not uh, too late 35 seconds RPK starting to back off Alex starting to get aggressive on rap side smoke to cover library Is gonna put some pressure on flamey towards the spawn arches Oh, the first player got past. Alex thought it was clear. He's eliminated. Good peek from Perfecto. Even though he's taken down, that's the bomb. So far away from the site. That should be the round. RPK has to straight up sprint. But it doesn't matter. Everyone falls. That's one of those rounds, I'm sure, if you're Vitality and you actually go back and watch the demo, you're going to be so annoyed because what it looks like with the overview is... They, they might not expect Boomich to be there. Yeah. Good first kill. Simple's going to go for the peek. Another leg shot. There's so many people at this corner. Vitality, they just, they're just they going to keep fighting at every single turn here. They line up, and Perfecto, he's doing a remarkable job at the moment. Oh. Getting already a lot, and oh, I can't believe it. Shock somehow bringing it back. A little bit of a team kill in mid, but it's still a two-on-one. Shocks, if he can find it, he's going to have a little bit of time. 35 seconds, he's got the MP9, and Flamey is on the other side. Somehow this actually turned. They should have lost this round already, Vitality, but they brought it back a bit, and Shox knows he's ready to take that fight. 25 seconds, stuck in the corner is Flamey. If Shox had any kind of a grenade, that would be a bad time. He's gonna fake it once. Still got a chance to play this game a bit more. Goes for the white peep, but Flamey will hit the headshot instead. These half buys very dangerous. All five players towards the A site, but these opening kills going all the way of Navi. Finally, RPK chimes in, but there's nothing more he can do. He does dink, <laughs> and now Simple. Two angles to manage, and he spotted him, and that's fast! Not knowing what fight to take, and all on his own. He saw that shoulder, Flamey gonna try and tap it away, but Alex actually gonna beat him to the punch, that's pretty good. That bomb side very much undefended. Boomich just turning around and trying to do a little bit of damage. Flashbang gonna be set up, Boomich, does he wanna come through? He's thinking about it, but he's currently just off on the coffins, and I think he's waiting for maybe another grenade to come through. Bomb attempted, Boomich oh, jumping no. in, getting the shot, and he nearly got it! The bomb will be planted at least, and it's a 2 on 3 so he could have almost won the round right then and there. Now it's electronic and simple, which was the real the power duo. Away. The Flamey's just putting out a Molotov towards the B-bomb site right now as he sees utility rain over, but this is a fake. This is a one-man fake towards that B-bomb site. It's gonna be all on simple and electronic. Good kill from Flamey, and simple's got the first. Oh, he just narrowly misses. Electronic trying to rotate in, but he's out in the open. It's gonna be hard to get a multi-kill for him. One player in power. Oh, now he's completely blind. In the halls, he goes down. Too much pressure. Yes, they've been in arch. They've managed to push their way through. A lot of things have been working out for the uh, T side. And there's Alex opening up on Electronic with an AWP. He didn't even have backup. He was just alone in the apartments with an orb. That's pretty bold. Well, look at this bold play. Speaking of it, Simple's moving into his position, and he's got an immediate headshot on Shocks. Back into a four-on-four four towards the B bomb site. It's the only map control Vitality has. They must make this hit work. 
Well, Boomich, they should be able to get down, although that CC is actually doing a lot of damage. It's Flamey back here, though, with that M4, and he's so deadly accurate with it. The flashbangs to set him up for a kill. He's gonna headshot Saiwu and take him down. And that means Alex, yeah, throwing away the AWP, saying, I am not gonna win this round, but I'm gonna try and make sure you can't get that gun. Again, they're getting all this mid control. It means they can wrap around. I think Perfecto's being set up with a flashbang. There was the one of them, but another one coming in, and they're gonna go for a bit of a double peek. And I don't know, they're not quite close enough. They still line up perfectly. A third flashbang, and simple to set him up for it, and Perfecto turning around even. Look at the Molotov damage. RPK burning again. Oh, a missed shot. This could spell trouble. Boomich turns the corner. Blind double kill for Boomich. And that was a flashbang set up from Flamey inside of the B-bomb site, so amazing stuff. But Shox is tired of losing rounds. He's gonna get a headshot once there. Perfecto out in the open. It's all or nothing, and I think he was turning for a grenade. He knew there's no more utility being thrown. I think Simple should get the information pretty quickly and start rotating over, but he's being cautious. So yeah, it is gonna be all in this boost. Here come the Molotovs. Here come the utility. Yep, throwing it in, but nothing going into the back. And you see they're not ready for the angle. Flamey with a big oh, double no. turns it into a triple. More bullets. Probably would have been a quad kill. It's a classic. Pop flash over, a chance for Boomich again. Oh, he's gonna throw it now and behind the board. Oh, Vitality's gonna be blind. It just came a second too late. Nothing Boomich could do to buy time for the pop flash to work out, but a new angle for Flamey. Right towards the angle, turns from his own flashbangs. And now the peak, RPK, nade in hand, he lines them all up! Flamey burns him down! Four kills, and 11th round for Na'Vi! I think that's exactly what's gonna happen. Now you've, you've laid it out for us, Jason. You're pretty good at the prediction stuff, so <laughs> let's see how this works out. There we go, he's throwing it in. Does it actually segment him? It kept simple back, and now they're being just completely shut down in the middle. The three-ray crossfire in effect. Simple trying to get it back, and he's incredibly accurate with that Glock, and Flamey will follow it up. I can't believe it, it's turned around. They actually did everything that you said, down to the second, and now it's a one versus two for Shox. He's on the bomb site, but they could pick up the bomb on the other side, and they still have 28 seconds. That's enough time to make it back to B if they want to. Instead, they're gonna run for rap instead, and oh, actually, they just run the other way. This they is let the, him go. This is the knockout punch. If Shox cannot somehow clutch this round, I don't think Vitality gets back into this game. I think this is where all the frustration boils over. Again, much like the pistol round, they're getting everything you could possibly want out of this setup. Two flashbangs there on Saibu. He's trying to play close in. Uh, they definitely saw him. They know. And Boomich will take him down. Shocks with one good headshot. 20 oh no. seconds. And they're starting to fall back. Oh, this is making me real nervous. Navi, have you actually left enough time for this? If anything goes wrong over on this side, it's done. And that might have already happened. Simple goes down to RPK. The archway. Alex on the other side. Eight seconds left. And they're trying to see if they can wrap through. And he's just ready and waiting. Oh, man. That is a bold call for Navi to be making. And... So if they could get a bit of room to breathe, maybe they can actually start to, you know, feel this game a bit more. <laughs> That's a great double grenade. Oh, what a slaughter. They have left Alex on the tiniest island possible. He's Listen, in Graveyard where there's literally nowhere else to go. Once I'm, you're spotted here, you're pinned down. I'm sure he'll be fine. <laughs> Try not to even worry. He's crouching in. There's the one. He oh continues to spray. He actually wants more and he gets it. Alex, three kills. It should be impossible. Otherwise, there, there would be no retake. This round would have been called already. If he just gets one or two, it's done. Eight seconds left. The bomb goes down here, but Navi, they are going to be furious if they lose this round. Three on two now, but Perfecto and Boomich, they have some health left to fight with. This might not be over in spite of everything that Alex just did. Trying to see if they can get a little bit of spam through the wall there, but not really connecting. And Boomich ready to stand up. A missed opportunity. Perfecto will spray them down. That could be very uncomfortable if he gets the timing down right on that. Apex just peak banana. They know it's not going to be B. Here it comes. Here's the hit. RPK not blind, but he's got utility in hand. Zaiwu saves his life and allows him that one kill. But now zaiwu has got to have a new angle. It might be another retake. Simple is ready for him if he comes. 18 seconds. Throwing down the bomb. Simple just feels like he's so exposed. No chance to get that kill. Oh, and there's Simple with the return. Taking down Alex and evening up the line here. It's two versus two now. Apex and Saiwu. He's got the kit on the AWP, which can get very, very odd. And Electronic is just hiding inside of the smoke, at least for the minute, exactly where he planted the bomb. There's still some time left. Apex gonna get caught, and now they just need to know, and I think they just saw it as well. They know where he is, and now they definitely do, and that makes it almost impossible. He's gotta save. He has a flashbang Apex, so he could maybe set up Alex for a pretty good spray down if, if the timing is well. And I'm guessing that's what they're doing here. 
Thinking about it as they come through. Alex will get the one. Apex ready to try and clean it up again. And just a couple of more seconds bought, and maybe his team will all be there anyway. Ten seconds on the clock, and they're going to go straight for the bomb plant. Can't really afford to do anything else. And they'll go. Oh! That is an absolute touchdown. Time's over. That saves the round. If Navi can get in here, retakes are not easy. That's a good shot creeping through the smoke. Now the boost becomes effective. Alex goes down. Big kills from Simple. Somehow he's got two. Right, that actually gives them an opportunity. Still 30 seconds. Problem is Electronic is low on health, and I think he's hiding inside of the smoke still, just waiting for that to clear like he's been doing all along. And he gets a headshot on Saiwu. He is exploiting that to the maximum benefit, and it's uh, really working out well for him so far here in London. Apex is sneaking around. I don't think Perfecto has any way of knowing that. And Apex, he's got the right idea. He definitely sees that, and a straight headshot leaving Electronic in a one versus two, and smoked off as well. This is going to have to be an absolute prayer for him to for this to even work close. And he actually gets a shot right through this short can't be happening. He's trying again. A bullet would take him down, but RBK maybe doesn't even know. The grenade and Electronic saving them one more time. A magnificent clutch. That Molotov actually does nothing at all now, setting up for the flashbang, but there's a lot of people waiting here, and he was not ready for it. Alex, the only one defending B, he goes down. They wanted to be aggressive and catch them off guard, and instead they might have just given them the map here. Three versus five. The bomb hunt's going to be going down and simple. Aggressively pushing to take down Saibu before the rest of the troops even show up. And look at this angle. Such a deep angle towards CT spawn. Even smokes. Wow. Yeah, well, his teammates smoked him out. <laughs> he could have had one more onto it, but yeah, that's not that's not the worst thing in the world either. Molotov behind the smoke, even if they come through it. There's no time to make this work. You have to find five kills and the defuse. More utility being spent. Flamey is just going to swing. And that's going to be it. Inferno goes to Na'Vi. They outlast a pretty admirable comeback from Team Vitality to take this map victory. And even though the scoreline is close, that first half, individually dominant performance for Na'Vi. Electronic was great. Perfecto was great. And Na'Vi are up 1-0 in the series. Yeah, it definitely took them a bit longer than I think they would have liked. This is going to be like almost like a delayed split. They want to keep the attention on long. Perfecto, Simple, and Flamey making their way up catwalk, but Alex has negated this entire defense. So what is the decision? What does Navi choose to do here? I really don't know. They need kills very, very quickly, and they might get them here. The headshots are coming through. Flamey and Perfecto, and RPK didn't know where to hide. I can't believe they end up losing this A-bomb site. They knew. Here comes more utility towards Catwalk, but at least Vitality held their nerve and didn't use utility the first time around. So this could create a very difficult attack for the Na'Vi offense. Zaiwu with the first kill, just spamming through the smoke, but he's completely blind. Out of the fight for the moment. And more spam doing a little bit more damage. Well, there's so much backup coming in. Perfecto's miles away. He wanted to catch rotations in the middle, and none have come through. So right now, they're just being stalled, and they need kills immediately, or this will not work out. Electronic gets dropped. Boomich, he's got one kill. Simple's there to help out. 30 seconds on the clock, and Saibu peeks right into it. Simple is ready, and they take the head off of RPK as well. That's Simple doing so much work, and now down the middle. I mean, Perfecto's already shown himself a shock. He knows if he keeps pushing, he's going to get shot in the back. What a triple kill from Simple in this round. And that last one for Shocks doesn't even matter at that point in time. Out long we go. Electronic staring right into the incoming flashbangs. And Apex was a little bit quicker to turn around. He's going to get the kill on him, no problem. And that follow-up grenade. I actually can't believe Flamey got any kills there. Alex has got a Molotov, so he could probably buy a bit of time in the A-bomb side if he doesn't go down directly. He's going to throw it a bit early, maybe. Simple jumps right down. If Saibu had been on the other side of that box, he probably would have been killed, but he wasn't. And instead, he's waiting for Perfecto in the middle, so they wanted to try and crunch him in there. Now it's Boomich 1 versus 4, and yeah, this should be no problem here. Alex, grenade, he had the sign in his mind, I'm sure, but it doesn't really matter right now. Saibu getting a bit overwhelmed, and Alex, because of the Molotov especially, able to stand on his own there, that's important. Yeah, thank God for that Molotov. Flamey's out long, RPK's dinked and still wins the fight. The Kree holding down the trigger, but Alex is under pressure now. And RPK with low HP, he might just want to try and control long and give up on this fight. He's only got six health. Anything will do. The Deagle shot is in. Overkill to the face. And Simple's going to get a plant, and this is a winnable round. Especially with that AWP on Simple. Anything is possible at that point in time. 
Vitality, you've, you've built your way into this. Now is not the time to be throwing it away. Shox is holding one angle and probably just caught in the end with Apex coming up from long. They've got them almost pinched it in right now. This could work out, but Simple will take down one. He spots out Apex as well. Perfecto with no armor up there. The M4, he gets the kill. I really love Duncan's analogy. Oh, oh, there's the first Jesus. one, Jason. You picked two. Shox was one of them. RPK and Saibu out at long at the corner. Damage and <laughs> right through the wall. Simple takes down Saibu, not even getting a fair fight, is he? He's building into this game. He's building into this map. He was a little quiet on Inferno, but Navi is just eternally confident at the moment. That's so quick. This is, what, 20 seconds into the round and four kills. Vitality fans still. A lot of deagles in play. Early couple of grenades to the corner. Clearing the way, of course, is going to be a Mac 10, but Flamey actually goes down pretty quickly. Still, they take care of Apex and a beautiful headshot from Shocks. They jump around. It looks like he could have done it. Saiwo also picked up somebody, and that was uh, Boomage dropping, so what a round. And Simple on the fly switching into the Creek. Wants to be able to use that. He gets aggressive. He's going to find both. The spray control is in. Otherwise, it's ruined. There's a pop flash coming in. Oh, first kill. Second kill for Boomich. Perfect flashbang. And it works again. Nice enough from Apex, but still a lot of trouble for RPK. And they're coming in from long as well. Flamey's a couple of seconds away. <laughs> Apex goes down and, yeah, RPK. Yeah, we've been got a whole game going on now. Auto shotgun. There are three people behind him, and he has absolutely been spotted. Uh, he's gonna have a chance, but it's not gonna be much. Great headshot on Perfecto, and Cyber took down Boomich. He's running for it. He wants to get it. He could have had it. Look at the health on Electronic. Ten of them left now. Shox is moving into the bomb site, but he can't really move in and defend it. He's just at the door waiting, and that might have been a smart move. They're bottlenecks. They can't get out here. Yeah, Zaiwu with the off shocks close up. Over the top of the smoke. Simple's got one. Excuse me. Maybe they can get in. That's so close. If he wins that fight, it's a one-on-one. -on -one. Fourth round for Vitality. That's how that's how many they got in the first half on on Inferno. Would love another one. And the money's not looking great for Navi. No, neither. It's, it's two for, Vi for Vitality as well. Huge advantage in this final round. Simple with the AK. Other than that, it's pistols. Two Deagles, two P250s, two smokes, and four flashbangs. Alex, again, aggressive in towards lower hulls, lower tunnels. And this time, there's no one peeking down mid, so they might not actually have this information. I don't think they do. Oh, and he's grouping up with Apex on the other side. Gonna run an electronic. Apex fighting, even spotting the bomb. So it was a very successful hit early on. Whatever Navi were planning, it's it's pretty much been ripped away from them. Simple, a chance for a one versus five. Those are pretty rare. Yeah, but he's got time. He's got time to pretty much go wherever he wants to find the next fight. They know where the bomb is. In upper dark. And Simple's posted up waiting. That's a that's a hell of a shot if you were to hit it. No one's gonna be there. Pushing out mid, you have Zaiwu with the AWP holding the angle, and in the lower B, he's got Alex. Still patient. This next one, that's... How do you win this fight? 50 seconds left. He is kind of banking on them actually moving into his crosshair at one point or another, and if they keep moving around, there's definitely a chance for it. 40 seconds now. Everywhere he goes, it's pretty much a one-on-one. -on -one. Although Shock's now sinking out of the upper dark, is going to join up with RPK, so that helps. 35 seconds now for Simple. Flashbang gives up his position. He has no idea. Long range. He goes for it, and they double up. If you're not able to win the pistol. Boomich all on his own, and there's nowhere to go. Even the Glocks are going to be effective through that car. And it's a shame, because they were pushing up middle at the same time. If Boomich hadn't got caught, if he could have stayed alive, it would have been interesting. Shock's ready and waiting with the clock, and he will win the fight. Electronic is there. He'll at least get a return, but this should still work out all right. They are at range with the USPs, though, so it's not nothing. The, the tough part is Vitality's boxed in. Now they have to go towards the A-bomb site. Perfecto and Flamey on Catwalk and CT spawn. Electronic now joining up with them. That could be an indication if Electronic gets a kill, they'll know the flank is clear that RPK can give it up. Three-man retake coming from Catwalk, and they need to win some stellar fights. They need to use these boxes really well. No headshots in that flurry. 
Perfecto is there. Flamey joining in. A lot of damage being dished out. And Apex goes down. Alex as well. And now they need to follow oh, it no. up. Another headshot. Flamey drops it. It's on RPK with the clock. And he's tapping away. He needs one more headshot. Perfecto oh. gets him in return. He's got the kit. And they have the round. Early smoke. And this is very cool. So that smoke is going to be popping up. Normally that means it's like five seconds before anything happens. But it's immediate. And Sybil is still not caught off guard. They try and get through, but they're so crunched up. But the damage is way too much for them to handle. A good shutdown. Double kill for Simple down the middle and a double for Flamey. Oh, he's, he's hyped up. This is those mid-round calls that Vitality has impressed people in the past with. But it's so awkward because he's here alone, right? He's going to walk right into that shot from Electronic. And now the rest of his team that are coming up can't walk. If they don't, that's success. It's all for nothing. Boomich will get a kill, but Saiwoo's there with a bit of a return, and they take down Simple. A huge double win there for Saiwoo, and that actually clears the path. Saiwoo's out mid with the AWP. He can have an angle towards CT spot. He can have an angle towards Karn. He's going to get it. Electronic not ready. Crumble if one of them dies. Simple is now trying to follow up, and that might actually be preferable at this point in time. He's going to go for the fight, and he takes down Saiwoo. Wants to re-peak it, maybe, but he's thinking better of it. Still under 50 seconds on the clock, so going back for the catwalk, and that smoke is going to obscure it a little bit, but he knows. He tries for the flick, and in pit, Boomage doing his job absolutely perfectly, and they're just doubling up. They weren't expecting Perfecto as well. The bomb is back here, and now nobody's going to be able to pick it up. That's an amazing defense for Na'Vi. They read, they, they got every single fight in the right order, more or less. Yeah, the flashbang to give Simple the angle. And Vitality peeked back into it with one of their own, but still a chance for RPK. He's been a god in clutches this weekend throughout this tournament. He's got to do one more here to keep Vitality alive. One versus two. He's already taken out the third player. And up towards Catwalk, the off angle for Flamey. 3AK is a Galil and a Scout. Fast pace towards Long. Flamey's going to line him up. Help of the nade onto Apex as well. Simple in the middle, not a scout, but an AWB to take down shocks. And that's good, it gives some information. Knows no one is pushing long just yet. Apex goes down, Boomish is ready for more of a no. fight in the middle, and they'll spray them down. A triple! They wanted to drop him, and he just took this series right from out under them. It's gonna be one versus five here for shocks with a Galil and... Yeah, some crushed spirits at the meantime too, you have to imagine. Simple's out there waiting for him, and Navi, they are looking like a very scary team at the moment. They're definitely warming up into this current form. The fact that Perfecto is playing so well, you see Simple having a good time enjoying his life, and obviously Electronic is still just playing like an absolute champion. So, yeah, this is uh, an amazing future they've got ahead of them. If they can just keep this going, you uh, have to expect big things. 16 to 6 as they take down Vitality on two maps. This is a version of Navi we just want to see more of. It took a while for them to get here, but it's certainly impressive. And